Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Holdfast and welcome back to the Time Shot Survival Multiplayer Server. Today, we're back to our to-do list. And number one on the to-do list is indeed the storage room. So, I've been uh, working away down in the basement here, and I got a little bit of a plan. So, check this out. So, we have all of our chests lined up the way that I kind of want. I think this is the way it's going to look. Um, I have to get rid of those there. Um, and underneath, oops, underneath each one is, oops, whoa, this is working really well. Underneath each chest is actually a crafting table at the front here, as you can see. So you're doing your chest stuff, and then you're like, oh, I gotta craft, doo -doo, and you go. On the other side, I'm still working out, because this is going to be uh, the side for furnace stuff and smelted stuff. So I'm not too sure yet, but I'm thinking that this is going to be the layout we're going to stick with. Um, yeah. This is this is gonna be it, guys. <laughs> this is gonna be some overflow stuff because I imagine this can hold quite a bit of stuff, but not as much as we're gonna need because we're gonna need a lot of stuff. So this is gonna be overflow plus all of the items that get smelted will be on this side, uh, except for food and stuff. We'll just do that manually. That's fine, no problem. Unless no, I can't do it. No, hmm. no. okay. <laughs> So we're going to do this today. We're going to build this up. Um, I want to give you guys a little bit more of an update down here. Uh, I did actually, as you can see in the chat, above uh, Edson joining and leaving. Uh, I got two achievements. Got repopulation and the lie, which I made a cake, which is now beside my fireplace. Um, as I said in, I believe, one of the first episodes we did, I want to try and get 100% achievements. Um, so we have all of these done, done. Still got to fly a pig off the side. This is all done. Um, done. Done, done, done. Oh, we're traveling the rail. I could do that. One thing I should do, actually, while we're here, is brew a potion. Let's... Let's... Do I have any sand? I'm not going to do it if I don't have any sand on me. Um, I don't think I have any sand at all. Well, then we're not going to do that today. Anyways, uh, I've been working down here. Chickens still doing chickeny things. Guess I'll go check them out. I don't know why. Again, I don't know why. If you guys tell me why I have this, that'd be awesome. Okay. Again, we started work down here the last episode. This is going to be uh, our smelting thing and our uh, our mining mine shaft. So this path is going to go all the way down there. We are at uh, Y67. This goes all the way down to Y12, and that's where we're going to make our mine shaft. It's going to be, someone asked me before, is it going to be uh, based on Minecraft mine shafts, or is it going to be something completely different? It's going to be different. It's not going to look like a Minecraft mine shaft. It's going to look like a holdfast mine shaft. So, without further delay, let's get working on the storage room and see what we can come up with. Uh, let's just do, um, get rid of these. I don't need this on my bar. I'm going to want this, going to want that, that, and that, I think. I've already made uh, all the item frames I might need and kind of everything else I, I think I have enough of right now. So I have an idea in my head of what I want. So let's just put it together. This kind of should work out pretty easily. Uh, let's go sides doo -doo, and the middle like so. Look at that. Looking awesome already. One thing I do need to do before we move on is get rid of these and fill them in properly. So let's actually. Oh man, some of these are gonna look pretty bad. <laughs> we gotta work on that because I can't. Okay, so that one's okay. That one's okay. I think. Ah, uh, yeah. We will, um, eventually, I'll go back behind all this and uh, fix it all. Make it look a lot better. But we're trying to keep with the natural look. That's why we're sticking with, with wood so that this stuff clearly looks like it's been built there. And it uh, looks cool. Anyways, eventually, we'll get rid of some of the torches and have glowstone behind here. But uh, as of right now, I kind of like this, this plan that we're going with. So, let's do that, that, that that of course try some of these put a stair there um, hmm this is tricky 
do that, and then we just do ah! do that and that, and that is essentially all I wanted to do. I think actually, you know what? Let's try to mix this up a little bit. Try and ooh yeah okay. So let's do that. Let's play with this a little bit. So this is the plan I I had. Now we're just kind of modifying it to make it look a little bit better. I think that looks pretty cool. Still looks like it's been handmade. It's kind of pillar deals here. These are holding up the supports, which kind of arch and stuff. And you can see the natural stone and blocks and stuff behind these, which is kind of cool. And you can still access the, uh, the crafting tables underneath. Now we just need to add our, oops, add our item frames. I didn't want to put the item, a lot of people put them on the side. So that you can say this chest contains this, 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 this. But I don't like that. I, I don't like covering up the details of the actual wood. So we're just going to plonk them right on the chest themselves. And hopefully that doesn't screw anything up. And do, do, do. And there we go. Half of our storage room is complete within minutes. How hard was that? And then we can dub, uh, let's make this. Let's make this one food. And I think I already put stuff in it. No, I didn't put anything in there. I put, yeah, I put stuff on there. So this one is now food. So we can start arranging our food as, as necessary. Like so. And then we'll, we'll continue to label these as needed. Um, they're pretty simple to get into. If you think they're hard to get in through the signs, they're not. Because you can just go like that. The signs are pretty easy to get around. So pretty simple. Pretty simple. Simple. Pretty simple. 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 <laughs> oh, okay. Um, hmm. Let me see. Let's throw that, that. Hmm. That. Doot, doot. And then throw that there. Ah! Ah! Thank you. And last one, perfect. Now we can get rid of some of these because it's nicely lit up and that helps a lot. Ooh, fancy. All right, give me one second, dudes. I'll be right back. All right, guys, sorry about that. Um, so yeah, now that we just kind of have to label each one of these dealios and we should be all set. I think we're gonna leave these, these looking like that. I think that's kind of cool, leave it open. Again, sticking with natural, natural looks, and I'm going to change the roof a little bit because I don't want this to all be just super flat and, and whatever. So we're going to kind of edit this a little bit and leave a few little holy holes up here. Ooh. And I'm kind of looking like I'm going random, but there is, an, there is a little bit of end plan here. And something like that. Make two up there. Probably have to fill some of these with uh, torches and stuff. Oh, put that there. That's going to have to be filled up. That's okay. There we go. Do something like this. Because I don't want it to just feel like um, it's just a Minecraft hole. That's going to have to be fixed. <laughs> yep, that too. Crap. Crap, crap, crap. Let's do this. I don't like having these hard corners. That's that's a big big no no in my books. Oh, look at there's some ores up there. Beautiful, beautiful. I know some of you probably don't like this and are screaming at me to not do it, <laughs> but I don't care. I think it looks looks cool. Probably keep going a little bit more. I gotta fill. I'll fill in some of this here. That's open. But uh, I think that looks so much better to me. Keeping the natural flow of the cave alive and well. Uh, let's do that and that and that and that. Oh yeah! Look at that, guys. It looks horrible. <laughs> Some of it's going to need to be filled in and fixed, but uh, I'll get there. We'll get there, guys. I promise. That's going to be how. That's going to have to be something I fix off camera. I think. Like all this crap needs to be filled in. Because some of this right now looks like it's floating. Which I don't really like. It's too bright. I don't like it. 
I'll fix that up. Don't worry. If I don't like it, if you guys hate it, then, uh, then I'll close it off. But uh, actually, one thing I do need to do, find a new place for my bed. That is important. We need a nice, comfy spot for the bed that is away from the chests. So, for now, because I have nowhere else to put it. Mm, right. Right there. Beautiful. Let's sleep. Let's sleep. Beautiful. Look at that, guys. Oh. Alright, so let's just go look at this again, because I'm kind of scared. I might... I might put it back to the flat roof, actually. I don't think that looks cool enough yet. I might do a little bit of work off camera, just playing around with a different, with some different designs. But I think right now that I don't know. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Your input would be most needed on this of all situations. Um, one thing you gotta do is fix that. Put that all the way up top. Same with this one. Yeah, that one. So, your input would be most needed there, guys. I would really appreciate some input on on uh, the roof, especially. And what do you guys think about this? I think this looks pretty cool. But again, your input means a lot, so let's help a brother out. <laughs> um, and then we'll have to figure this side out, too. So we can we can kind of scratch storage room off the, off the list for now. I just need to figure out the layout that items are going to go into here. Because we have a few options. What you can do, like, you can do cobble, and then I don't have any, but you can do smooth stone, and then you could do that, which is like gravel and dirt. Uh, then you could separate them by a different tree type, or uh, I, there's so many different options that we need to figure out, guys, and I need your help big time. So, that is cool that we got one side done. We can actually start moving items up here, I think. Up here is going to be a lot of food things, so we might do cooked food and like raw food and um, seeds and stuff down there. That might be cool. Over here, um, I'm thinking smooth stone, stone, gravel and dirt because we don't need a ton of that, but these two will easily be filled up and I'll probably fill them up pretty quick. Um, and then these six can probably be all wood, I'm imagining. What we can do, because I only use two types of wood. I only use uh, the, what is this, spruce wood? Yeah, I only use spruce wood and, oak, and a little bit of oak wood just for items and things. So what we could do is have um, the, uh, what's it called? These things. These things right here. Oak wood. Oh, crap. Ah, crapola. Oh, that just destroyed my sign. Oh, man. What am I doing here, guys? Okay, that. That. Okay. So up here we could have the two different... I'll put the obviously different ones. The two different main wood thingies and then have that down here. And that down here, which would also include stairs and half slabs and stuff. And then we'll put uh, saplings down there. And then any other wood will just overflow in here. I don't actually own any other wood. <laughs> I don't own any wood. I don't have any other wood. There is no other wood in my life. So, like, we can put this stuff here. This isn't all wood items, though. These are, though. And then we'll have, like, our random over whoa. overflow chest of, of wooden items as well. So, what we can do is here. This is what? This is oak? Yeah, this is oak. So, here we can put oak. And then this down there, maybe, and then that right there. But what I like to do, obviously, is spread them out so that uh, you can just shift-click all your items straight in. And you're happy. And up here, we can do the same. Just do that. And you have oak wood. Up here, I have zero spruce. <laughs> um, three. Nine. Which is cool. And one. Very nice, and of course, I'm going to definitely do this. Yep, doing that. Do that. But we'll spread this out a little bit, because we're going to have tons and tons of stone. And of course, down at the bottom here, what we can do is the oak one. This is going to be oak. Throw a sapling. And, oop, don't want to do that. And throw all of our saplings here, and then 
all of our leaves will have here. Like that. Yep. Yep. Just like that. So you can just easily shift click all your items straight into it. And we'll do the same with with the spruce. I'm gonna start farming away trying to fill these chests. I really, really, really like to have all of these chests completely packed full is the plan. That's that's what I'd like to do. I'm gonna have gravel down here and dirt here. Might end up with a lot of dirt, so that's cool. And actually an offshoot of gravel will be flint. So I'll just leave that there. Um, now one extra thing that I that I'm thinking about is this might be we might you always need a an assorted item chest. Um, now that assorted item is like these signs, trapdoors, sticks, fences, chests, item frames. Those are all made out of wood. Unfortunately, I don't think we have. I don't want to just chuck them all into one of these item frames. Um, so I'm thinking I might just do a random, random item, random wooden item chest here. So like we'll have just a big row of sticks, we'll have some of those, we'll have a few chests down here and some fences and stuff like that. And of course I'll reorganize all this eventually but that, that's pretty cool. I think we're, we're pretty happy with that so far. Um, what are we going to do with the rest of this? Um, hmm, let's go pick up a few more of our items and see what we're going to need because we have some options here. We're going to need some nether stuff of course um, we're gonna need another portal actually. Let's just grab all of this <laughs> and transport that quick rooney. We're gonna need a chest for nether items. Man, we're gonna need a lot of chests. Check this out. This is gonna be full in no time. Come on, there we go. Full in no time. Let's go finish off the stone. And then these will be um, more of kind of just generic overflow items. Just grab all this stuff. And there's another thing. We have stone, uh, smooth stone, we have furnaces, we have uh, what's this called? Stone bricks, which we'll have to throw in. I like to throw the stone bricks in this chest. So let's just finish this off. Those in there. And then of course these stairs will have to be in there. Um, and furnaces we'll put in here because they are made out of cobblestone. And then stone. Yep, that's it. And then we'll throw the stone bricks. We'll have one row of stone bricks. Crack stone, mossy stone. That's about it. <laughs> oh, and some of those. And then of course down here we have our gravel. And we're happy with that. That makes me happy that these are kind of done already. Hmm. Beautiful. And then what do we have? Done. These I'm going to leave in here. I'll take that though. And that. Those I'll all leave. This is the main chest of crappiness. So let's start by taking food. Salmon. Doo -doo. So I'm thinking we're going to do raw um, seeds and cooked food in three different chests. And we'll have to do mob drops in another one too. Man, so many chests. Um, hmm. That's kind of not a food. Now should it be just a consumable chest? Because technically consumable is cool. Hmm. I'm going to get rid of sugar cane. Even though it kind of does fall under food because it can be turned into sugar. Let's just take it. Mushrooms, sure. Those can fall under food. I think that's it, right? I can't see any more. Take that with me. I think that is all of our food. Um, do a quick check. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay. Sweet. So let's chuck this all up here. So we'll have three different items. We'll have um, hmm, cooked food. We'll have... See, that kind of looks like a cooked potato. Hmm. So this is beef. We'll do raw beef. And then we'll... Crap. And then we'll do uh, just seeds. Now, cooked food. Let's chuck in our. Let's get rid of that. Cooked fish. Um, that's it. <laughs> um, raw. We have raw, 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 raw. Rush, rush, rush. Um, some of those. Technically, that's raw, raw, 
It's cooked, but I'm still eating it. <laughs> and then seeds. We'll have seeds. And that's it. Oh, I forgot my raw salmon. There. Cool. So that's good. Eventually the seed one will fill up. Um, we'll also have other cool items in here. Like, um, actually wheat can go in there and stuff. But uh, actually, you know what we could do? Technically, this is raw, but I'm going to put the this down in the seed one. Beautiful. This right here. Um, actually, let's go pick up some more items. Next up, we're going to do the mob drop furnace. Or mob drop furnace. The mob drop uh, chest. Oh, more food. This can go under food as well, I think. Or mob drops. Mob drops. Mob drop, technically. Um, mob drop, technically. That's it, right? Arrows can go under mob drops. Sure. We'll need that, and 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 that. And good. All right. Giddy up. This will be about it. We'll finish doing up a few of these signs, and then we'll be on our way, I think, for today. Um, so we want to do... I don't want to use that. I want to use this. This is a mob drop one. Mob drops. Mob drop. Mob drop. Um, mob drop. That. I think that's... I don't need all those, so those can go under mob drops. Leather. I think can stay under mob drops. Technically, see the bone meal uh, technically comes from a mob drop, but it doesn't, it isn't a mob drop, if you know what I mean. I'm just going to kind of organize these a little bit, not in any particular way. Um, so, eh, eh, I don't know. Here we're going to have gear, is what this is going to be. Just random gear items so I need that don't need those don't need that again I'm gonna organize these a little bit better than we do but that's it for now food raw food is apples of course and then over here we need some more flint beautiful this is coming along really well guys I like that that's cool um, we need just another sapling there for those <sighs> so Majority of our other stuff is going to be on here. Whatever we can't fit in here is going to go over there. Like ores and stuff like that. So we'll have an ore, a few ore chests. Um, what else do we need? I, don't, I can't think of too much else that's going to go in here. Um, this might actually end up just random other consumables such as that. Consumable, consumable. It's torches technically, but... Hmm. We'll just, yeah, we'll leave that like that for now. Let's go finish up these chests over here. So I think two on the right are finished. This one is not finished. These rails can actually stay here because I'm going to be working on that. That can stay here. Um, ores and stuff like that can stay here, except for those. I'll take you with me for now. See, there's other random things i got to figure out where to put them. Mob drops? Consumables, I guess. Uh, ores and other such items. I think that'll about do this. Sugar, I need that. Take that. Um, nether chest, we'll put that somewhere as well. To figure out another chest. Ooh, little chickens laid an egg. Um, shit. Yeah, let's do that. That looks much cooler. Okay, mob drops, mob drops, mob drops. Okay. Uh, then we have more consumable items like those. We'll put the put that like that, and then just keep that. Much easier. Sugar. Oh crap! I just clicked that thing. There we go. Sugar can stay in there, and consumable. We'll just throw paper in here as well. And technically, torches go into there, but we're not going to do that because I'm I'm holding them. So that's a good start. Um, let's make this one our nether chest, I think. I think that's that's probably a good idea, and then we'll leave this for now, because it's, it's quite random, to be honest. There's nothing really pertinent that we need in there. Uh, this is all good nether stuff. Beautiful! And we're going to be all set for our freaking storage room, guys. This is exciting! What do I want as the nether... Let's see what looks better here. Um, this one or this one? 
thinking this one here. Yeah, let's do that. Nether items. Come on. There we go. Fill it up. Wow, it's almost an entire row. That's crazy. Put those here. And some of that. Of course, lava we'll just keep in there because lava. Glowstone. And... Magma cream. Magma cream can actually go under mob drops. Cool. Um, quartz. And I'm going to actually keep this under consumables. Perfect, guys. Look at that. What a start. Now, if you have any other suggestions about the layout of this or where certain items should be placed or kept, then please feel free to let me know. I'm always open to your suggestions. And look at this, guys. Our grass is finally 100% complete. Except for here. It's the last block. I, if In case you don't know, in case you didn't see... Oh, this one, too. Um, I wanted to bring some grass in here to bring some green. So I opened up... Uh, you can see a pathway of dirt here. This led all the way outside, and uh, I fed in grass from the outside until finally it led all the way into here, and we now have grass, and it is beautiful. So this is what we have so far, guys. Isn't that exciting? So exciting, and check this out. Check this, check this. I'm not going to use these right now. I'm not going to use power rail just yet, but we can do this. Woo! And I don't technically need torches in here because mobs don't spawn on these things. I just need to work out the power rail distance um, because we will need power rails in here since uh, we're going to be traveling up as well. But isn't that cool? That makes me very happy. We're making progress, guys. Making bacon progress. Cool, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. We can tick one thing off the list. I'm going to check it off right now that we have a storage room. At least the beginnings of it. It is, in my opinion, this is complete. We just need to specify more items. I need to collect more items. And then it'll be perfect. <laughs> and then over here, this is the furnace stuff. So we'll leave that on the to-do list for now. But uh, actually, is it nighttime? Is it nighttime? Okay. All right. Well, thank you guys for watching. I really hope you enjoyed and I appreciate your... You're spectating of my shenanigans, so thanks a lot for watching, guys. I hope you enjoy, and we'll see you next time. Bye.